So that means that the Arma Fire team, the Arma Fire team actually made it through one pack over here at uh, the original Diamond Dust. So I'm going to finish this rip out with ripping the Red Cat Racing Kaiju if you're interested in watching that. But I've got to burn that pack because I suspect I should be able to just like this guy, uh, Kaiju, just like this uh, fire team, I should be able to burn through the rest of that pack for the um, Kaiju EXT. So anyways, this is RC Guy Garage and I was out ripping the Arma Fire team. Finally, finally made it through a stinking pack. Again, I mean, it's made it through a couple of other packs, but I'm going to check on that bearing. The uh, driver's side has a shielded bearing, a single shielded bearing. So we'll see how that made out. I just had an absolutely awesome rip with the uh, Arma Fire team. So now it's time to just finish out this pack because uh, this thing did get a little bit too hot. So finish out the pack. And then it looks like that's going to be the end for today. I'm not going to be able to get to the Mojave. The light will basically be gone. But that's the way it works, man. This body has definitely seen better days. I don't even know how it's held on on the back here. So running this thing without a wheelie bar definitely seems to be a positive experience so far because the wheelie bar almost kind of gets in the way. And I feel like almost hindered the uh, performance of this vehicle. So, it's just my personal opinion, and I'm sticking to it. Whoa! This thing has just got so much power. What was that? That acted like I got a hold of a cable. The way the car just like whipped around. Whoa! What was that? Fishing line of some kind of cable or something. Something hooked it. Looks like all four wheels are going. Something hooked the car. Cause that was weird. That was too weird for it to do it like that. Driving on all four. I don't see anything. That was weird. Car seems all right, but the steering is slightly off. <laughs> it's better without the wheelie bar. Yeah, I actually think it's better without the wheelie bar, but you will be buying another wing. Oh, this thing is meant. This thing has just got so much power. Oh my God. This thing cooks. Yes, this is what I've been waiting for with this thing, man. I'm telling you.
been waiting to see what this thing could do. I finally figured it out, man. Holy smokes, man. Like literally smokes. Ah! Then it crashes. It's actually all right. Oh my God. Look at this thing. Thing's ripping. <laughs> I think I love this thing now. <laughs> oh man, I would race this thing. Holy smokes, man. There's so much smoke and not enough wind. Oh no, this can't be good, man. Wheels up. That just means destruction. Ah! <laughs> and it still goes! Ah! <laughs> and it still goes! Damn. Oh, dude, I finally figured it out, man. You have no idea how happy I am right now. I thought this thing was a piece of garbage. I mean, not really, but I just couldn't figure out what it wanted. This thing loves just speed. It's a speed monster. Look at that. It's almost like a wheelie on command kind of thing. Ready, wheelie. No. Oh, crap. <laughs> Ready, wheelie. Oh, oh, God. Even on low cut, it goes fast. <laughs> oh, it's it. It's dead. All right, man. So anyways, this is RC Guy Garage, and I am, I'm basically done ripping it over here for the night at Diamond Dust. You can see behind me, we've got the little bit of the sunset going. This thing is an abs, oh my God. To finally, I'm telling you, I know I said it last time. But to finally figure out where this thing should run, it's such a weight off my shoulders, man. Because every time I would look at that thing, it was like, what the heck do I do with it? And I finally decided to go ahead and fix it and pit it up against two RCs that cannot stink and hold a candle to the speed that this Kaiju EXT reaches. I mean... I almost feel like I'm going to have to put a GPS speed meter on here and I'm going to have to wrap it in foam because if I don't, the GPS speed meter is going to self-destruct inside the truck. So anyways, I'm over here at Diamond Dust. I am I RC am Guy RC Garage. Garage. You're you RC Guy Garage. Oh, no, I'm just kidding. just kidding. I am RC Guy Garage and I am just having a blast, like I said, over here at Diamond Dust. My God, like I said, man. Things yelling at me right now. Why is it yelling? What are you yelling about? That's <sighs> probably cooking. Probably just something got in there. Could be I lost a blade. No, I did. <laughs> I lost a bunch of blades. Oh no. Yeah, I lost a bunch of blades. <laughs> so it's like one of those multi blade fans. So it's got like one, there should have been one there. So it was like one, two, three, four, five. Should have been six, seven, eight, nine, ten, like a 10 bladed fan. 
I think it's a 10 bladed fan. I think I'm only running on four blades, so. Oh, it looks like, uh, it looks like I'm gonna have to toss a fan in there, but that's quite all right, man, I'm telling you. With the enjoyment that I just got, I'm over here, I'm able to enjoy a little bit of the sunset that we got going on right now. I wish it was a little bit better. Obviously the sun is setting over there. You can see like right there, you can see it's brighter. And obviously as you pan over there, you get the clouds just lighting up. I'm having a blast. Hopefully you guys, whoever you are out there in this RC kind of hobby world, even if you're not part of the RC hobby world, get involved in it. It's actually pretty stinking fun. So I'm out. I'm out ripping it up. What are you doing?